Uh, hi guys and welcome to the Bloodborne walkthrough. This is, uh, we're just going to take on the DLC in this video. And once we've done this, we can uh, take on the last few bosses of the, of the main game. Yes, this is the Hunter's Nightmare. And I absolutely love what they did with this DLC because they've kind of, they've like upped the, uh, the difficulty level for this. So, um... Getting to the bosses is a lot harder. Some of the bosses in this DLC are much harder than in the base game. Uh, so it makes for a bit of a challenge, especially if we're doing these on like New Game Plus and stuff. So let's uh, <laughs> attempt to get some of these done. Yeah, I'm gonna kill this guy first. I don't know why, but. Just turn it down a bit. Uh, like I can never tell the volume for this because as soon as you start fighting uh, an enemy, the volume just jumps. So hopefully this is okay, okay for you guys. If it's a bit too loud, just let me know and I'll turn it down a bit. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of uh, hunter players in this area and they're just a little bit harder to uh, to judge hopefully I don't get too many deaths but yeah I'm just gonna be searching for items as well making sure I uh, collect everything because there's uh, some really unique weapons in here as well that we're gonna pick up One of my favourites as well, a bit later. But it feels good playing with an actual new controller. One with grip on it. Um, yeah, so like these beasts, they automatically start off a bit scared. So it's like, like you've already got your torch out. But they're probably just like shitting it because of all these hunters that are around them trying to kill them. But we've got, um... So in this playthrough, I've kind of just like like beefed up on her damage. I haven't really bothered about her HP or stamina that much. So uh, I, I don't know. I feel like it might be a little bit harder to take some of these guys out, especially when you have to. take out some of these guys. But yeah, some of the weapons are absolutely amazing. I haven't played with that one yet. I played with the boom hammer, which was that, that other guy's weapon. Uh, but yeah, 
yeah, just to check and make sure I've got everything in this in this area. Who knows? Remember, quick weapon. All these ions. So I think there's a, an item that we have to drop off for anyway. Down there. Some more shards. Um, and yeah, this is just like the normal playthrough as well. So we haven't gone through any of the chalice dungeons to get the uh, the better gems for the weapons. We've just got basic ones that you can obtain in this playthrough. What the hell was that? Oh, there's a little trap here. I didn't realise that. There's going to be some more of those throughout the game as well. So let's head back. It's a bit of a shame, like, I don't know, like, they couldn't have made this uh, 60 FPS. Healing up before taking on anyone in this uh, in this area. So fast. That's like the um, <laughs> uh, the bone cleaver. Oh, we're going through for this. Um, <clears throat> Let's go over there. Okay, <clears throat> so we're gonna head down, open the shortcut. Get some of those pebbles, and this is just where we run up and kill that guy at the start. Um, let's carry on. A few more guys to kill in this area. <laughs> and that's where we would have just uh, come up from. Now this bit. I absolutely hate this bit. Let's heal up for this. Take all these guys. For this guy, uh, if he hits shot, he's gonna take another one as well. It's got follow-up attacks. It's mainly that one. Absolute nightmare. This guy's killed me a few times. Fuck, and there we go. 
we go. Fucker. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ. It's just ready. Those ones are okay. Fuck yeah. <laughs> that guy is just that guy is solid. Like everyone else is like okay, but that guy. I don't know, it's just a bit tricky sometimes. Uh what do we have down here? Don't worry about those though, we've killed all of those. guy up here. This is probably the hardest enemy in the game. <laughs> I don't know if I want to kill him. I might just leave him. Uh, uh, but yeah, like that, other, that last one had red eyes, so he's like obviously a bit harder than the others. Uh, this guy, however, um, is on a whole new level. He is just solid. Get up, man. <laughs> so when he does this, like he just emanates from his axe, so whenever he hits you, Like there's the first impact and there's the shockwave from his axe. Fuck, he's chasing me down. Uh, like the hunter's nightmare is just kind of like a mirror in there 
of the normal world. So we've got this uh, figure up here. Uh, eye pendant. Let's have a look at this. Uh, eye pendant that unlocks the surgery altar. Uh, there are two cathedrals in the Hunter's Dream. One lies past the River of Blood, and another contains the private research hall of the Healing Church. Only chosen members of the Healing Church or their lamentable patients can enter the research hall using this eye. Grant eyes to the surgery altar skull. Nice. God. So that guy with the uh, with the axe is kind of like a he feels like a mini boss is really hard to take on. Um. So hopefully that should be the hardest part of the DLC. Okay, that's not true at all. Oh god, so this is the bridge where I just walked into that cannon fire. Essentially, all we have to do is uh, get around here. Uh, okay, and avoid that one. Didn't see that one there, so there's like a hidden one. <laughs> Just here. Crazy. And they've... And they've one hit hidden one bar beside the carriage. But yeah, you can just like run to this side. And now we've got like another hunter with a boom hammer. Uh, and these guys, these start throwing stuff. As long as we get that hit, it doesn't matter if we get hit. As long as we get that parry in it, it doesn't matter if we get hit. So we can just uh, get it all back. Because I don't think those ones stagger, so even if you just like R1 in him, he's gonna just hit you anyway. Yeah, these guys are not nice in New Game Plus. Hey. I had to lay Molotovs. Uh, there's a, I'm not gonna go down there just yet. I'm gonna finish out this area. What is it? They're going to explode. Is it when we pick it up? Yes. <laughs> yeah, just grab it and run. And then there's that. 
Uh, so boom hammer is a really nice uh, strength weapon. I did uh, do one of the new game plus playthroughs with a boom hammer. Not all the way, just had it as kind of like a secondary weapon. But man, I wish I did. It does some serious damage. And just bounce back off. Pretty on point with stuff like that. And the dual sense as well kind of uh, vibrates to like the weight of the weapon and what you're hitting. As uh, well, the beast guy. Just wondering, does he go for this? Could have got a backstab on him then. Oh man, too far. He's gonna be like, I'm pretty sure you could just hit him. Stagger him a bit. Don't have to try and get any uh, special moves in there. Uh, okay, there's nothing else here. Put the um, claws. So, what the firing hammer badge? of the old Otto workshop. Uh, the powder kegs were driven by the singular idea and crafted strange weapons of great interest <laughs> intricacy. It is clear that the philosophy of the powder kegs was already established at this time. Uh, do we get any other ones as well? But yeah, I think that allows you to uh, get the beast claw of the hunter's dream. I think that might have to be one of their one of their new game playthroughs on this the uh, uh, beast mode. Yeah, I think it's the Ashen Ashen uh, gear set as well. All oh, right, I hope these guys are going to be nice to me today. Before I take on these, I'm going to open the and lock the shortcut. If these guys would be so kind as to stop firing at me, to try some. Not the one. Okay. Can we just run? Just run. Are they gonna follow us? No, nope. just gonna stay there. Uh, okay, easy tactic. Just run, get the shortcut open first, and then we've got this stranger over here. You're a hunter with your sanity, aren't you? Must have taken a wrong turn then, eh? 
Well, we're more alike than you think. This is the hunter's nightmare. Where hunters end up when drunk with blood. You've seen them before. Aimless, wandering hunters slavering like beasts. This is what the poor fools have to look forward to. So, don't be brash. Turn back before it's too late. Unless you've something of an interest in nightmares. Uh, nightmares are fascinating. Oh yes, I see. You sense a secret within the nightmare and cannot bear to leave it be. As if the spirit of Bergenworth lives on within you. Such inquisitive hunters will relish the nightmare. But beware. Secrets are secrets for a reason. And some do not wish to see them uncovered. Especially when the secrets are particularly unseemly. Beware. Especially when... Ah, cheers, pal. Thanks for that. Uh, okay, and that's shortcut unlocked. 